Welcome back to Performance Nutrition for Wrestlers. This is Clint Wattenberg, sports dietitian and former assistant wrestling coach at Cornell University. Today, we're going to talk about fueling your weight loss. Remember, the first key to a successful weight descent is starting the process early so that lean body mass muscle can be preserved while body fat is burned for energy. It is critical to provide energy to your body when it needs it. We're going to break energy expenditure down into two components, your baseline energy expenditure and your exercise energy expenditure. You can think of your baseline energy expenditure as your metabolism plus any activities of daily living that you're going to be doing on a regular basis. The key to fueling your baseline energy needs, regardless of training period, is including a balanced plate. When in weight management, the importance of protein as part of your training plate is never more important. Consistent protein intake from the time you wake up through the time you go to bed is critical in preserving your lean tissue when in caloric deficit. For a list of good protein sources to help support your weight management, check out the handout that I provided with this podcast. I also have details of other nutritional properties that these protein sources may offer. Since you are in the weight management portion of your training cycle, it is important to be in a caloric deficit. Remember, your body can only lose up to 1.5% of your body weight per week in body fat. For our 150-pound example, this correlates to about 2 to 2.5 pounds of body weight. Any caloric deficit that you need for this weight loss should come from this baseline energy expenditure. A 500-calorie deficit from your baseline needs should be deducted for each pound that you are attempting to lose. While protein should remain high and can be as high as one gram of protein per pound of body weight, it is going to be the carbohydrates in your diet that need to moderate in order to create this caloric deficit. The carbs in your diet should move from being main courses to side dishes to support the protein and the fruits and vegetables within your diet. This will enhance muscle or lean tissue retention while making your diet much more filling. By choosing lean protein and unprocessed carbs, you will eliminate a lot of unnecessary calories. The exercise energy expenditure, on the other hand, should always be 100% fueled. Include carb options pre-workout, even when in weight management and counting calories, so that you have energy for practice, and then carbohydrate and protein options coming out of practice to support recovery, repair, and a healthy immune system. By fueling the energy for activity, you're enabling your body to train hard and recover optimally, which is the key to this fueling your weight management process. Thanks again for joining me. This is Clint Wattenberg with Performance Nutrition for Wrestlers. Next time, we will talk specifically about fueling practice and competition. But until then, make sure you like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, or leave comments below. You can also tweet at us using the hashtag MyWrestlingNutrition.